It was absolutely brilliant tonight and it's interesting how the show has grown this year. I mean last year it had it had I, I felt a real warm heart at the center of the show and that's what I loved so much about. Uh, I feel this year it's an, it has an even bigger heart and and I think that my sense was tonight that the audience here in Belfast felt that. So I'm absolutely thrilled. It's the story of a young boy growing up in the Troubles um, and while all this conflict is going on in the city that he lives in he's more interested in outer space and comic books and Doctor Who and of course Sharon Burgess who's the girl um, that he's in love with. She's the girl who lives inside my dreams the girl I depend upon when I see her, that's when my heart attacks. I want her to be my own Olivia Newton John. What kind of blows me away every time with, with YMT Productions is um, you know, the, the short space of rehearsal time and the culmination of so many hours of, of rehearsing and enthusiasm and talent. So I'm definitely reassured by previous performances and, and involvement with YMT that it, that's going to be really good. We've become like a family, like the whole cast, and yeah, I think like the production team have been outstanding. It's such like a great process because everyone is just a like, big massive family and you become so close with everyone. What's really great about working with these young people on Paperboy is they have a chance not only to explore 1970s Belfast and the cultural impact that that had on that time, but they can relate that to what they're doing today and their lives today. So not only has this project been a really great artistic project for the young people where they've learned about staging and they've learned about how to tell a story to an audience and make an audience laugh and to bring heart to the piece, but they've also, I think, learned a lot about life through this project. The production team, the creative team, are immensely talented in what they do. They've been an absolute joy to work with, and well, an honour and a privilege to work with. And even the pastoral team, the chaperones, they are incredible. Um, you get to learn every single day, and um, there's things that seem scary at first. You go, oh, I don't know how I'm gonna do that, but with the help of the creative team, uh, very much helps you develop as a person, um, especially in the arts industry as well. So the show is set in 1975, so we had to look at specific dance moves from that era, uh, bring those into like the disco scenes, we learnt some of like the authentic dances they used to do in the Westy Disco, which was really fun, um, and then also incorporated loads of other styles, so we had like um, uh, body popping Cyberman and cartwheeling characters, and um, yeah, we basically drew on all of the skills that the young people had to bring. For the production of BYMT Paperboy, uh, one line to sum it up would be um, absolutely bonkers. Mm -hmm. um, it really is crazy. I 